Hey everybody, week two, it's finally here. Actually, I think it's like a day early, but that's okay. Yeah, I mean, I might be a little overzealous, but whatever. Tomorrow's going to be a long night, so I figured I might as well do it tonight. So anyway, so this week I'm reading you a poem that I called Splash. Uh, you might guess that I was swimming right before I wrote it. Uh, and it was like February and it was like really, really cold outside. And now I was cold when I wrote it and just got, I just took a shower and tried to warm up. So whatever. Um, it's a much more somber poem than, than the one last week. And, uh, hope you like it. Um, so let me know in the comments what you think. Thanks. Without any further, here's Splash. Splash. Feel the water on every inch, the breathless pressure pushing up to the top. Breathe out, breathe in. Kick your legs, move your arms, breathe. The smell, chlorine, for the first time in years, bringing a sense of home, belonging, wonderment. A mist feeling, weightless, breathless, Strong, weak, tired, too soon, breathe, underwater, eyes open, breathless, home, on the backboard, breathless, lifeless, home, breathing again, feeling again, wet, stinking of chlorine, cold, Alone, dry, smelling of chlorine. Splash, breathe, home. Cool. I hope you guys like that one. Uh, it's definitely one of my favorites. It's uh, it's called Flash Poetry. It's uh, definitely a, a more interesting style of writing. You basically give just a, a small snippet of a line and usually just like one or two words and it's just... Sends a sends a very powerful message. Let your mind do most of the talking, uh, because poetry is all about what you get out of it, not what the writer put into it. So, um, so anyway, let me know in the comments, and uh, don't forget to subscribe. All right, thanks. Bye bye.